Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to take a look on the frog light frame. Soon I'm going to release a build video. I'm just waiting for some parts to arrive. I already have this Brother Orbi motors that Banggood kindly sent me for a review. So this is going to be a 5S build. So this is the returner 2300 kV motors. So once all the parts will arrive, I uh, will release a build video. By the way, there are two versions. One is the racing frame and this is the light version. This one costs a little bit less than 30 bucks. So if you're looking for a budget frame, this might be the right one for you. So let's start by unboxing this box and see everything we're getting inside. Inside we got the instruction manual, the side plates, the arms and all the necessary screws and holders. So what I'm going to do in this video, I'm just going to assemble this frame and then weigh it up and hopefully everything will arrive soon so I can start building this quadcopter. So I finished assembling everything up, it wasn't that hard, I just didn't put, this is supposed to be on the back, you can choose between this part and this part, and they just go here. In addition we have this button plate that holds the battery, and we have this part that sits in the middle and holds the flight controller. The weight of the frame is just over 100 grams. The thickness of the arms is 4 millimeters. The thickness of the top plate is about 1.4 millimeters. The thickness of the bottom plate is about 1.7 millimeters. This frame is designed to work with cameras like the Runcom Swift 2 and the Aero 3 and it will fit just right in so before placing of course this side plate you will have to put it inside and they wire everything up. So thank you for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it in the next probably two weeks or so I'm going to release the build video so stay tuned and see you on my next videos. Goodbye!